Welcome fellow 6502ers, I'm Fred. Like most of you watching these types of videos, I'm an electronics hobbyist. I normally dabble with microcontrollers, but ever since I watched Ben Eater's videos on the 6502, I got bit by the 8-bit bug. Today we're putting together the memory. Although the end goal will be to add non-volatile RAM and bank RAM, I'm going to concentrate on wiring up the ROM and the RAM. I will install a 32KB Renaissance 71256 RAM chip, which is mapped to 20KB. The ROM is a 32KB 28C256 Atmel EEPROM. Later on, I will add a 512K Alliance AS6040-08 RAM chip, mapped to 64 pages of 8KB, as well as a 2KB STM48T02 non-volatile RAM. Due to a camera issue, Forgot to press record. I don't have the first few minutes of the build. Regardless, I hope you enjoy. All right, I'm finished for the first part. Uh, I've done the ROM and the RAM. I haven't done the NVRAM nor the bank RAM 512K bytes because it's a long process and I don't need it right now. What I do need to do is to make sure that this circuit works. If you look at Ben Eater's videos, um, he goes into more details into doing bit by bit testing the ROM and then adding the RAM and whatnot. I've done this before so that's why I went forward and did all of this because I wanted to have a proper layout. Now for me to test it and because I do have a functional um, monitor program which I'm going to adapt to test it out is I'm going to add an ACIA here. So I'll need to add some decoding and uh, put the ACIA and have a breakout with a DB9 connector uh, for uh, hooking up to the computer. But that's going to be the subject of next episode. So stay tuned and be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell to receive updates. This is Fred, the micro hobbyist, signing off. Take care.